Welcome to our tutorial on the point. The point sub toolbar is right here. Let's undock it. First, I'll create a point by clicking. Activate the point command. And as you can see, the feedback shows our position. After one click, Katia creates a point. If I double click on the point function, Katia lets me create a few points in a row. Click again on the point tool to deselect it. Now let's try cre creating a point by using coordinates. Let's enter one vertical and one horizontal. Click OK. And here is a point. See what happens now when the point is selected. I'll use this tool again. The next point appears one vertical and one inch horizontal above the selected point. Again, let's select the point. Now let's enter different coordinates. Two horizontal and one inch vertical. And the point appears right here. Before I show you the next tool, let's create a three point arc. Click on the background to deselect everything. Now I'm going to create equidistant points and select this arc. As you can see, Katia created three equidistant points on this arc. I can increase or decrease the number of points, but let's just leave it at three for now. Before showing you the next tool, let me create a line. Okay, deselect everything. The next tool is the intersection point. Now I'm going to select the line I just created and the three point arc. Now, as you can see, there are two points where the arc and the line intersect. Let's click on the area to deselect everything. The last tool is the projection point. Let's project this point to this line. Deselect. Or we can project, for example, the same point to this arc. Let's delete everything and show you one more thing. I'm going to create a shape right now. And let's say we need to create an intersection point right here. Oops, I should deselect the shape before having done this. Let's delete it and go to the, our tree. Delete these points. OK, let's try that again. This line and this line. Now we have our intersection point. The sketch is underintensified because I accidentally clicked on one of the tree lines when I deleted the points. Now, watch what happens when I try to create a solid. Select Pad. Under Sketch, I'll select this sketch. Katia now gives me a warning. The selected sketch contains points defined as standard geometrical elements. Let's click No, Cancel, get back to our sketch. What is the problem? Let's find it. How will we do this? I mean, in this situation, I do know what the problem is, but I want to explore how we can find out this problem in a different way. Select Tools, Sketch Analysis. I see here I've got one closed sketch, and I indeed have an isolated point here. So let's select this point and convert it to construction geometry. Close it. And let's create our solid again. Pad. And now 
our creation of a solid was successful. This concludes our tutorial on points.